Well, what's going on, everybody? Well, I have some not-so-great news. It all started when I was trying to join my vacation, and my Flickr account got deleted, my second one. And at first, I didn't know why. They, it just was disappeared. I couldn't log in. I reached out to them, and they said that they deleted it because it was risky. Now, I was a little bit bummed out about that, but also kind of pissed off because, like, what? Uh, th why aren't they gonna elaborate any farther than that? Like, do you think an answer like that would satisfy me? Of course not. So I replied, can you specify a little bit more? Uh, actually, I didn't, I didn't reply, uh, because I got a warning on my first account that if I didn't remove certain content, it would be deleted too. And now I was really, really mad at Flickr because they didn't specify anything, so I had to contact them, which... I don't know if they were trying to get me to contact them for a reason or anything. I don't know why they didn't maybe elaborate a little farther. Like YouTube will elaborate further sometimes, like for copyright strikes. So I asked them, you know, hey, like, hey, what content needs to be deleted? Because I have a ton of photos on there that obviously I do not want to remove. And then uh, uh, they responded saying, oh, any photos you don't have copyright to, you can't post on Flickr. So that basically meant all the photos from old websites like Wayback Machine Finds and photos people sent me and photos found on the internet. So yeah, I reached out to them, they told me, and then as I was going through, I was like, are they gonna ask me to delete screenshots of Google Street View? Turns out, yes. I asked that and they said, no, you can't post those because you're not the original photo taker. Okay, and at that point I had lost it. So, I, I'm i still in the process of trying to figure out what to do next. I've started deleting all the photos that aren't mine and all the Google screenshots. Uh, my old account still has some of them left, like a lot. Uh, but basically what happened changed my mood about Flickr a lot. And if they're going to get me to get back on again and start uploading more stuff, they're going to have to change the way they do stuff around here. So there's a lot of things wrong with it. Now, I'm not trying to do say this because I'm, I'm not trying to blame anyone for doing anything wrong. Sure, you know, I don't own the copyright to those photos, so technically I guess not. But the rules weren't very specific when I went to read them. It didn't really, it wasn't really too specific as far as I can remember. Now, if they had contacted me earlier, like when I had just started doing Flickr, maybe even a year or just a month after I started doing all that, I would have been a little more pleased to do what they said to do, but after like almost two to three years of being on Flickr, getting a fan base on Flickr, getting views and faves, and being successful on Flickr, they shut me down basically. Like, who would want to go back to Flickr? Who would want to go back to any platform that does that? And another thing, why me? Why do I get, why do I get banned and warned when there's tons of other Flickr accounts like? like all the other refuse industry fans who have posted Google Map finds in the past and in the present. What about the, the, those accounts that posted Wayback Machine finds in the past and in the present? Why didn't they get banned? Like, why why now and why me? I'm not, Again, I'm not trying to make this like a sob story or anything, but think about it. Why would, why would they suddenly just go after me and not literally all the other old uh, filmers' accounts that have these kinds of photos they have google Maps screenshots like they are screenshots and yet just and yet i get banned for doing the same thing doesn't make sense right and they waited two to three years to contact me so what are the inclusions well be careful what you post on Flickr. apparently they're getting more strict because just a couple of years ago it was fine i could post those and had no problems whatsoever and now this when I when my account got banned at first, I thought someone had mass reported me, but it turns out no, it was Flickr's system. They were doing it, and they basically just dropped bombshells on me. So what am I gonna do about it? Well, if you follow my Flickr accounts, I posted an announcement, a text announcement, and it said I'd be doing stuff on Blogger now, which is a Google's old blogging website. I don't know how many people even know about that website, but I've known about it for a while and. I think it's a safer place for me to post pictures freely. And since I don't have Instagram, 
uh, I think, and and since it's free, and since there's not really many restrictions as far as I know, I, I think it'd be a safer place for me to post what I want to post. Uh, Flickr, I'm sure, has many, many, many photos that aren't people's that uploaded, and I'm sure they're working to get those down, but I, I just feel like I've been targeted somehow. And I, I'm not trying to take others down with me. I'm really not. But it's kind of strange that suddenly, all of a sudden, now, 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 you get ban I get banned for doing this, that stuff. So yeah, uh, I'll put the blogger link, my blogger link in the description. That's where I'll post Google Maps screenshots, Wayback Machine finds, even my photos sometimes. And as for my Flickr accounts, what am I going to do about those? Well, I'll remove the copyright content because I really don't want to get my Flickr accounts deleted because then I can't use those emails again and I have run out of emails to use. So, yeah, that's going to be a problem. And yes, I'll still be on Flickr checking other people's photos, liking them, commenting on them, following other people. But I, the reason why I'm not going to upload to them anymore is because they, they kind of it seems like they don't really want me on there anymore. Because I've been uploading photos that aren't mine. And if they had told me about this, like, a year, a month, and a, a month after I started doing Flickr, I would have been happy to oblige. But after after they just literally took away everything on, about my Flickr account, I, I don't feel very, I don't feel very uh, sympathetic to Flickr. And I'm not going to be uploading again for a long time. Uh, so yeah, and by the way, this is not an April Fool's thing. This is actually real. Check my Flickr accounts. I deleted a ton of photos from them. Uh, and yeah, I'll see you guys on Blogger. I'm not sure how to follow Blogger accounts, so if you see a follow button and you have a Google account, you can follow me on there. I'll definitely be posting on Blogger way more. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.